I've heard of rubber chickens before at a hockey game, but not a live chicken. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 wildest animal incidents in sports. Three points, Australia. There's a dog on the ground. It's got everything. There's a dog out on the ground as well. Can you believe this? And if this Cowboys season doesn't go the way it was expected to, blame that guy. This is incredible. It's making a run for it. For this list, we're looking at moments when animals crashed major sporting events. Which animal incident made your jaw drop or had you laughing hysterically? Let us know in the comments. Number 10, Rally Squirrel. And there's a squirrel that ran right in front of home plate. During a postseason game between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Philadelphia Phillies, a squirrel captured the attention of baseball fans when it ran across the plate in Bush Stadium and then into the stands. Distracted by the squirrel, Phillies pitcher Roy Oswald threw a pitch that was considered to be a ball, which irked both the Phillies player and the manager, who later said he would have shot the squirrel if he'd been armed. The St. Louis Cardinals, for their part, considered the rodent, which they nicknamed Rally Squirrel, a good luck charm for contributing to the momentum that would win them the 2011 World Series. What a team! What a ride! The Cardinals are world champs! Number 9. Black Cat Curses the Chicago Cubs Sometimes a cat running loose in a baseball stadium can be good luck for the team at bat, like Rally Cat was for the St. Louis Cardinals in 2017. However, a visit from a black cat didn't work out so well for the Chicago Cubs during a September game back in 1969. The Cubs were leading the New York Mets in the pennant chase until a black cat darted past Cubs third baseman Ron Santo before he went to bat. The cat would prance around near the Cubs' dugout, at one point even staring players down. After the cat left the field, the Cubs went on to lose that game to the Mets, who would later win the World Series that year. Many believe the cat jinxed the team. Which is why the incident is often considered another infamous moment for one of the unluckiest teams in baseball. Why did it walk in front of our dugout instead of the Mets dugout? I got no idea. Number 8. Manu Ginobili versus the Bat An October 2009 game between the San Antonio Spurs and the Sacramento Kings was interrupted when a bat flew in and wreaked havoc in the arena. Here's the outlet pass, there's the bat! Spurs shooting guard Manu Ginobili stepped up and took on the bat, slapping it down with one hand and then picking it up to get rid of it. Oh, Manu knocked it out of midair! A similar event occurred in 2013 when a bat disrupted a college basketball game between Marquette and Providence. However, no one confronted the creature. Add bat swatter to Ginobili's many accolades. That led to a series of uh, vaccinations that he was going on to say it was a very painful process. Number 7. Bees Swarm Training Game Yeah, there they are. Now the question is, how do we get them out of here? Given the bitter rivalry between the Yankees and the Red Sox, it takes something serious to distract sports fans from it. Something like bees. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh sure. Get in the catcher's equipment bag. That would be great. Somebody's glove is really uh, becoming like a beehive. During a 2014 spring training game between the two teams, bees swarmed onto the field during the third inning temporarily halting the game. When the grounds crew was working on the problem, Yankees first baseman Mark Teixeira hilariously picked up some honey jars to see if they would help solve things. Of course, this wasn't the only such incident, which can be concerning for fans attending the game, especially those who are allergic. A similar incident involving bees occurred at a May 2013 game between the Anaheim Angels and the Baltimore Orioles. They have swarmed right on the screen behind home plate, where the uh Robo camera, the remote operator, is located, and uh, you can see how many of them are there. Here's hoping there isn't a hidden correlation between bees and baseball. Number 6. A Seagull Steals Steve Lowry's Golf Ball While playing on the 17th hole at the 1998 Players' Championship, golfer Steve Lowry came across unusual interference. This seagull is, uh, <laughs> he wants to take it home for a souvenir. Lowry and Cooley and Fable just laughed. After Lowry's ball landed, a seagull picked it up, flew away with it, then dropped it in the water. <laughs> oh, uh -oh. No. <laughs> Does that count as an official ball in the water? Fortunately for Lowry, he was not penalized and was able to hit the ball again without the seagull having any effect on his score. Nonetheless, it is kind of scary to think that all of your hard work can be ruined by some confused bird who shows up from the middle of nowhere. Anything can happen at 17. Number 5. Mick Fanning Attacked by a Shark When the worlds of animals and sports intersect, 
It can play out as cute, or at worst, annoying. But for Australian surfer Mick Fanning, things got downright terrifying at the 2015 J Bay Open in South Africa. Just jumped like away and then he just kept coming at my board and I just was like kicking and screaming and well. <laughs> While the three-time ASP world champion was competing in the final round, a great white shark popped out and dragged him underwater, causing a broadcaster to curse live on air. Holy shit. Excuse me. Fanning retaliated by literally punching back and, aided by competitor Julian Wilson, was able to make it back to shore in one piece. Big sigh of relief seeing Fanning in one piece as we saw the fin out the back. Wow. Number 4. Pine Martin Attacks Player During Swiss Soccer Game In 2013, a soccer match between Swiss teams FC Thun and Zurich was interrupted when a Pine Martin ran across the field. In a hurry to get the game back on track, defender Loris Benito was able to catch the critter and pick him up. However, for his act of bravery in picking up the wild animal, Benito suffered a minor injury as the Martin fought back and bit the player's finger. The lesson here is never mess with the Martin. Number 3. Formidable Flame Runs Away From Southwell Racecourse In 1997, a freak occurrence took place at Southwell Racecourse in Nottinghamshire, England, when a racehorse named Formidable Flame escaped from its stall right before a scheduled race. It then left the track and ran loose among bystanders. Please do keep calm, stay as still as you can. During its rampage, the horse crushed a baby carriage, but miraculously, the two-month-old infant inside the carriage was not harmed. Fortunately, neither the baby nor the horse were hurt, but the baby's parents were treated for shock. The horse then ran into the betting parlor before it was eventually subdued. I do believe that the horse is now being caught, and obviously, The uh, tack will be taken off. The cause of the incident was thought to have been Formidable Flame being upset by the crowds. To all those planning on attending a horse race in the near future, do not anger the horses. Number 2. A Kangaroo Pretends to Be a Race Car As cars were buzzing by at the 2007 B8 Supercar Championship in New South Wales, one kangaroo got the bright idea to join the race. When cars saw the kangaroo hopping in the middle of the track, Several swerved to avoid hitting the marsupial, with at least one car veering off track. Oh, that is so scary. Somehow, they all avoided that kangaroo at the top of the hill. We've seen that what is that... amazing. That was Whoa. amazing vision. Fortunately for animal lovers, the kangaroo was able to leave the track unscathed. Since the 2007 incident, there have been quite a few kangaroo-related episodes, which have been seen as a security concern for obvious reasons. Oh, and that was the reason why I heard Garth leap onto the radio. Off you go, mate. Before we unveil our top pick, here are some honorable mentions. Dog interrupts soccer game. Seagulls at AT&T Park. If I can tell you if I were sitting out there with my wife where we would be in the car. Three-legged alligator crosses fairway at Zurich Classic. This is this, all of, this is all about the slow play rule now. This is to get the guys to play a little bit faster. <laughs> just, put, just put an alligator behind oh, them. Okay. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Randy Johnson Explodes a Dove The winner of five Cy Young Awards, Randy Johnson is one of the greatest pitchers in the history of baseball. And Randy Johnson has become the first pitcher in Major League history to strike out 300 batters in four consecutive seasons. One memorable moment of his career happened during a March 2001 spring training game against the San Francisco Giants. In the seventh inning, a dove flew in front of home plate and, upon contact with one of Johnson's fastballs, exploded, leaving only a pile of feathers. Sadly, that poor bird found out the hard way that when the big unit throws a fastball, you do not get in front of it. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.